In this tutorial, I will show you how to remove pimples and blemishes using Photoshop. Welcome, my name is Marlon and on this channel I make Photoshop tutorials. Once you have your image open, the first thing we are going to do is remove the pimples and blemishes. Press the D key to reset the foreground and background color. Select the spot healing brush. Now we are going to click on the individual blemishes to remove them. Note. You are not using a painting motion, just clicking on the individual areas. You can increase or decrease the size of the spot healing brush by pressing the right or left bracket keys. Once you are finished removing the blemishes, the next step is to duplicate the layer. Select the image layer, click layer, then click duplicate layer. Name the layer smooth skin. And then click OK. Now we need to change the blend mode of the soft skin layer to overlay. Now we are going to convert the smart skin layer to a smart filter. This will allow you to go back and change the filter settings if you need to. Click filter. Then click convert for smart filters. If you get a message box, just click OK. We are now going to invert the smooth skin layer. To invert the layer, press Ctrl I. For Mac users, press Command I. Once the layer is inverted, click Filter, select Other, then click High Pass. Enter 10 for the radius and click OK. Now we are going to add a Gaussian blur. Click Filter, click Blur. Click Gaussian Blur, then lower the radius. The more you lower the radius, the smoother the skin will look. You don't want to lower the radius too much because we still want to be able to see the skin texture. I am going to use 1.2 for my image. Then click OK once you have selected a radius. We are now going to add a mask to the soft skin layer. Select the soft skin layer. Press and hold the ALT key, then click the Add Mask icon. Now we are going to start smoothening out the skin using a white soft brush. Click the Brush tool, then go to the Brush Properties and select the wrong soft brush. Now start painting over the skin. Do not paint over the eyes or the lashes because you want these to remain sharp. There you have it, a simple way to remove pimples and blemishes using Photoshop. I would like to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Please leave a comment if you found the video helpful. 